I was already a pretty like go with the flow kind of person, but after traveling around the world, I was really worried about coming back and that kind of going away from how I already was living my life. But now that I have a motorcycle and I've been traveling through the United States, that stayed, that openness to adventure, that saying yes to things that I normally maybe wouldn't. I guess my first introduction to motorcycles was my dad had an 89 Sportster, all customized. And when I started traveling around the world, I saw that it was a normal thing for backpackers when they visited Southeast Asia to get motorbikes and ride across country. So I called up my brother. I said, hey, I wanna go ride motorcycles across Vietnam. We bought bikes for $170 and for a month, we rode across the country all along the Chinese border. And the way we were meeting people and how great it was that they were like excited we were on motorcycles. All the feelings and all the adventures we went on in that month really like set the stage for how my travel was gonna be after that. That's how I kind of fell into a motorcycle culture there and I was absolutely addicted. I knew I needed to get a motorcycle. I knew I needed to get back on the road. And Harley has a different culture of its own. Immediately after I purchased my first bike, I was building up a new community here. And I think it played a huge role in wanting to go with the Harley brand. You pull up on a Harley, you've got friends instantly. I think motorcycling, it's a way to be connected, connected to where you are and the people around you and anyone that has made their way to two wheels. It doesn't really matter what got you there. That's what we have in common. It's definitely made my life better. I love what it brings to my life, that sense of adventure. Just being able to load up and go. It's like that itch comes and I pack my bike and I go.